Most animal advocates are in a bit of shock tonight. That's right, Caitlin. This is all after the governor vetoed a bipartisan bill that would have expanded animal cruelty laws. Fox 26's Randy Wallace joining us live from this on this story from downtown tonight. Randy. Jonathan, so far, Governor Abbott has vetoed at least 20 bills. They only needed his signature to become state law. Now, the governor is calling Senate Bill 474, which is known as the Safe Outdoor Dogs Act, micromanaging. Shocked. Absolutely shocked. Felt like somebody punched me in the stomach. All those who fought for Senate Bill 474, the Safe Outdoor Dogs Act, say they can't believe Governor Greg Abbott's decision to veto it. We are at a loss for words. Um, the governor's team never weighed in on this bill one way or another. So quite frankly, we feel rather blindsided. The state needs it. Houston needs it. We had law enforcement officers behind this. We had both houses behind this. Lots of support statewide. We don't know what happened. The bill would require that dogs left outside have adequate shelter, food, and water. It would have actually given a definition for adequate shelter, and it would have clarified what a proper tether is, required water, and also removed a 24-hour warning that is currently in the law. The last animal cruelty law was passed in 2007. It's been described as vague and difficult to enforce. There has never been a ticket written on the 2007 law. But now the governor is calling Senate Bill 474 micromanaging, and he says Texas is no place for this kind of over-criminalization. Many dogs died in last winter's Arctic blast. We had thousands of calls to animal welfare groups asking people to help animals that were tied up outside, and many of them died on the ends of their chains. This bill would have protected those animals. Randy, as tough as it is for me to say, Yes, it's dead in the water, but we will continue to fight. And you know, in Texas, there are other cities that have an ordinance that cover this. Houston does not, so we really relied on the state legislation. Now, in a statement, Abbott says Texas laws already protect dogs by outlaw outlawing true animal cruelty. Now, if you'd like to share your thoughts with the governor about this, we're going to have some phone numbers and a link for you on our website a little later tonight. Reporting live from downtown, Randy Wallace, Fox 26 News.